everybody. Today we're going to do a review of doll number 84. I already took her out of the box. Actually, I thought I was filming it, but something went wrong and I pushed the wrong button. But no matter, I'm just going to tell you all about this beautiful doll. I was attracted to her because of her beautiful sunglasses. They're just so different. They're like mirrored glasses. I just love them. Of course, I did also love the doll. I think this doll is just so, so pretty. I love her freckles and her skin tone just goes beautifully with the auburn hair. She's just beautiful. So she's got brown eyebrows, blue eyes. Doesn't look like there's any eyeshadow on there and she's got the sprinkle of freckles on both sides and a little bit even over the nose. She's got these pale pink lips with some white teeth showing and I just love her hair. Partly tied up in a ponytail halfway and it's gorgeous and long and it's cut a little bit more evenly than many of the other dolls that are such ragged cuts. So I just love it and the color is stunning. I like her outfit as well. She's in this really nice knit dress and it's striped. It's got pink stripes and blue stripes and some green stripes. She's got a green necklace that's pretty much like the one the doll Pretty in Pink has, only hers of course is green and here is pretty in pink pretty in pink her necklace is purple her top is pink oh i think she's called future is bright not pretty in pink that's right but getting back to this one they were both curvy so is the other one and so is this doll she's got flat feet inside of white flat sneakers they just love making these flat white sneakers so many of the dolls have those shoes and I wish they gave a bit better variety. But no matter, I love her anyway. She's got two straight arms. I do wish one of them would have been bent at the elbow because that does give a little bit more flexibility for posing them in videos and in uh, photographs, but that's okay. I think she's lovely. Now, on the card and what i had said when i opened her is she came in a larger box than the other fashionistas do it's a wider box to accommodate the outfit and on the outside of the box you can see her right there i have not seen the other three dolls in stores but they all look really interesting especially the dark haired one and this one with the braids i'd love to get them next so i'm going to keep an eye out for them and on the back of this card just like the other fashionista cards they've got a bunch of dolls lined up but it is a much wider piece of cardboard because it needed to be wider to hold the extra outfits and she's got a gray shirt a pink purse and this pretty little floral skirt that I'm going to change her into and we'll be right back and now here she is all dressed up in her other outfit. Hi there! This looks really cute on her. In fact, I think she looks more youthful. That striped dress was cute, but it made her look more mature. And this one's a really fun outfit. It looks almost like a dress when she's got it on. And it's got a cute ruffle around the sleeves. It says Fashion Queen on it in black writing. And it's got this cute fake black stitching. It's just printed on, but it's done so well, it really fools you into thinking that it's real stitches with thread. It's got Velcro down the back. The skirt has an elastic waist in it. Um, it's a really pretty skirt. I love the flowers, the pink and blue flowers. And I wish they would have given us another pair of shoes with it. That would have completed the outfit. That's for sure. And she's got the purse. 
So here's the purse that she comes with as her added accessory. And what I like about it is I thought the strap of the purse was going to be really stiff, but it's not. It actually moves a bit, which makes it fit much more realistic around her. So I really like that. I love everything about this doll. I think she's beautiful. I just love her freckles. I know they made a doll recently with dimples, and I want to get that one as well. But meanwhile, this one I waited such a long time to get don't like paying the extra money and of course because she came with the extra outfit they charged a lot more for her but she's worth it because she's beautiful and I love her and I'm going to use her in my very next video so she's one more for my curvies I'll have to get all my curvies together and make a video just of them but for now it's just her my beautiful new redhead doll Oh, let's just smooth out her ruffle on the sleeve there because the strap of her purse was getting in the way. And she's just all ready to go off and have a great adventure. Bye, Barbie! If you enjoyed this video, please hit the subscribe button down below on the side and touch the bell so you'll be notified of all future videos. Thanks for watching! Bye! See you soon!